welcome back to my channel this is Nat Fab Life and I'm coming at you with another beauty inspiration so with this video I'm going to do a comparison of some very light makeup looks just something quick out the door but you still want to look fabulous so I'm going to compare the ColourPop this one's called pretty fresh and I'm going to compare it to my favorite max next to nothing all right additionally I'm going to do the model bushy brow look I know you guys are like what is that something we used to do in the 90s but I think it has its own little flavor um, all right so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put the color pop on one side and I'm gonna put next to nothing on the other side and then I'm gonna do my brows and then I'll let you guys be the judge towards the end tell me which one you think you like all right first I'm going to put on some primer I'm going to use this one Walmart this doesn't take a whole lot but that one comes out kind of clear I'm so excited because um, as much as I love max next to nothing I um, this tinted moisturizer by ColourPop might be my new favorite. We're going to see though. This is how it looks when it comes out. I'm going to take the some of my orange um, contour powder from here and I'm just going to put it over those little blemish marks. If you have perfect skin, don't worry about this step. I hate you by the way. <laughs> I'm kidding. Um, just going to get a little bit of that orange. Just a little. Right now I have nothing over here and I have color pop over here. You can apply with a foundation brush, but if you do, just remember to go in small circles as you apply the rest. All right, so that was one pump and I'm going to now max next to nothing. One pump. Gotta open it. So, I don't know if you guys can tell a difference or not, but um, ColourPop, MAC next to nothing. Can you guys see a difference? Um, I just want you guys to judge which one you like. I'm going to zoom in just a little bit more for you so you can get... Now I'm going to do the model bushy brow. You need a, a brow brush, one with tiny bristles like such. Um, the tiny bristles so that you can grip all the hairs. And you need a soap, maybe a clear soap. Um, I tend to think you can do this with a primer or something, you know, thick and tacky but clear. Um, so what I'm going to use is the Neutrogena, Neutrogena Soap, uh, face soap. Why am I doing this? And I'm gonna wet it and then just going to um, rotate your brush across that soap. I want you guys to kind of see what I got going on here, okay? Yeah, you want some of that tacky, that thick, you know, that, yeah. Okay. See the difference? Model bushy brow, Natalie's brow. Yeah, okay. 
Let's do the other one. What do you guys think? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This is called a bushy model brow. And if you want to, you can um, you can finish it off by you know going in the other direction. walk out the house just like this like here it is so just need you guys to judge it okay so that video was um for those of you who just want to step out the house with a little bit of something not much um here it is I hope you enjoy that um, beauty inspiration. Not much of a tutorial, but just something to share and see if you like it. Please let me know down in the comments which one is your favorite. Um, I kind of like ColourPop. So the MAC Next to Nothing gives me more of that sheer, I think glowy look. And then the ColourPop gives me more of a coverage a little bit more coverage so it just depends on the look that you're going for yeah it's a little glowy over here right all right guys thank you for watching join me next time bye